everybody, welcome back to Miran TV. My name is Miran Kirikosian. We have another amazing tutorial with Pop and John. Today we are focusing on head and neck isolations. You will get some amazing tips that are gonna make your head and neck isolations really smooth, okay? If you guys want more tutorials with Pop and John, I'm gonna put a full playlist in the description box, so make sure to check that out. Also, if this is your first time on this channel and you have not subscribed, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell to get notified every time we release a new video. Also, leave your comments in the comment box. Let us know what else you would like to see on this channel. Let's get started. What's up, everybody? Poppin' John here again. That's right. Thanks for Miron TV for having me. Um, today, I'm going to be breaking down a head-neck isolation. How to have your head stuck here in space and moving your body around it, all right? So, remember that the logo's flipped back there because this uh, video is mirrored for you to follow along a lot easier. Let's jump into it. All right, so first we have to learn how to isolate the head by itself, okay? So an isolation is basically moving one, one body part by itself and the rest of your body being still, okay? So my head, I'm really focused on keeping it straight up and down, okay? I don't want to turn it too much like this or like this. Okay, I really want to keep it straight forward and then push it to the side. Okay, it's almost like um, I'm listening. Like when you're trying to listen. You can't hear it very well, but you're like listening over here. Okay, so almost like I'm stretching my ear as much as I can. I'm trying not to have my shoulders move or anything. I really just want my head to move. Boom. Okay, we're going to go side to side. So one side to the other. All right, I'm really focused on keeping my face straight up and down, and I almost imagine two lines. Okay, I almost imagine two lines right here. My head being one line and my chest being the other. And this line goes to the side, see that? And then to the other side. So basically, I'm keeping this one still, and this line is going to the side, boom. And I'm keeping my head straight up and down. I don't wanna do this or too much of this where your chin is off to the side. And if you can't move very far, it's okay. All we need is this much movement, all right? So really focus on just keeping the head straight up and down. Boom, 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 side to side. One side, the other side. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so we really have to learn this move in order to get this one down. See how that, the movement is the same through the neck? Watch, bam, 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 bam. My neck is doing the same thing. All right, but I'm just timing it differently, okay? So let's get our head to go to one side, whoop, all right, straight up and down, and then to the other. One side, the other. One side, the other. Bam, 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 bam. You really wanna get comfortable with this movement. I use this all the time in my dance, okay? You can use this type of isolation in waves, you can use it in robot. It kind of goes from this basic move, like really far advanced, okay? So bam, 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 side to side. Okay, it's almost like you're talking trash to somebody. Bam, 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 all right? Okay, so now that we have this side to side, we really have to think about where our torso is, where our shoulders are. All right, so I send my head to the side, and this is the best way to find this um, timing, is think about where you are close to this shoulder, and you're gonna basically move your body to that side, and at the same time, you're gonna move your head to the opposite direction. Okay, so it's, I'm on one side, and then I'm gonna shift to the other side. At the same time, and all I'm doing with my torso is like kinda just leaning to the side. Boom, boom. All right, so that's how you get that, that illusion. I'm still thinking about these two lines. I don't want them to be doing this too much, okay? Here, boom, to the side, and then I'm gonna bring my shoulders 
to that side, and I'm going to push my head to the opposite side. All right? So I'm like this, boom, bam. All right? And then I'm just going to rewind that move. Boom. All right? Boom. 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 All right? It takes time to really get that down. And I promise if you, if you practice in front of the mirror, that helps the most because you can really like focus on your head being like stuck in space. OK? So we have a line and a line. We're going to take that line to the side. OK? And now we're going to bring this line past it. Boom. See that? OK, now this line's on this side. So you can see this bottom line's the one that's moving now, OK? But basically, I'm doing both things at once to keep my head stuck there, OK? So I'm going off to the side, boom, and then I'm going to bring this one past it. See how now I feel my head over on this shoulder. And now I'm going to take those shoulders to the other side, to the other side. Boom, 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 boom. All right, I'm really focused on keeping my head straight up and down. And I'm going to give you guys a couple of secret uh, ingredients for this, OK? So one is if I have my head up, the move doesn't look that impressive, OK? You can like see all the neck, and it doesn't really have this like big illusion, OK? The moment that I start to hide my neck, check this out. So I'm hiding my neck with my face and my chin. And then I'm going to go side to side. Look how much different that looks. Boom, boom. It's because you don't really see the neck, so it looks like the head is really like disconnected from the body. All right, so I'm hiding my neck, and then I'm going side to side. OK, I'm doing the same move as this. Look, it doesn't look like much here. And then, boom. See that? That's where the big illusion happens, is when you hide the neck. OK, boom. And one thing that helps for some reason is like when you grab your chest, and you almost feel like you're pushing it to those different areas. OK, I feel like my arm is coming, grabbing my chest, and sending it to those sides. But the first move is really thinking about these lines, head, and then the torso, side to side, all right? The really cool thing about this move is that it goes like all the way up to these really advanced isolations with the head and neck, all right? So one of them is, bam, going side to side, hiding the neck. See that? My head starts to look like it's kind of disconnected from my body. And then I can start playing with all these circular motions. OK, so that's where I'm bringing my body down and really kind of playing with that isolation and that movement. OK, it takes time, but where I learned this move is staring at myself in the mirror and really finding those sweet spots, you know, the sweet like balance where the head just kind of gets stuck there in space. OK, and the more you hide your neck, the better. See that? can do these, where we're sectioning each piece. See how it looks like I'm pushing my head all the way to the side, torso all the way to the side. OK, you can really start to play with these movements. All right, guys, I'm going to demonstrate some of these uh, techniques that you can take from just this simple head neck ISO, OK? Check it out. We got it. a lot of time in practice, but practice in the mirror. Watch yourself. You can almost like stare at yourself in the eyes and see all of these different movements happen. And you can really feel it when your head starts to move. So focus on keeping everything isolated. And um, yeah, it takes time, guys. Uh, I hope you're having fun. I hope you guys are learning. 
Um, again, thanks Miron TV for having me and uh, have fun with your head and neck isolations, guys. Boom. Peace. Hey everyone, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial with Pop and John. If you guys want more tutorials with Pop and John, we're gonna have a full playlist in the description box, so make sure to check that out. Also, all his social media links will be there too, so don't forget to follow. If this was your first time on this channel and you have not subscribed, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell to get notified on all the releases. Also, leave all your comments in the comment box. Let us know what else you would like to learn on this channel. I'll see you guys on the next one.